Focus. I got something we're trying out. Medium format, 16 year old digital back. How does it hold up for today? And is it something you wanna look into? Is it even worth looking into with what they have in digital 35 millimeter stuff right now? So we'll check that out. I wanna see the dynamic range. What else? I wanna see the tone, the color, the dynamic range, and overall look of this back compared to my USR. So what we have right here going right now, P20, the phase one P20 on the back of a Mamiya 645 AFD. Using this Interfit uh, Honey Badger, <laughs> using a PC sync into the Mamiya. We're gonna be focusing on this monopod that I have. Exposed. that's good so that was the flash test I wanted to do with just overexposing and seeing how it handled overexposing because digital you want to expose for the highlights and I'm seeing if that still applies to this old uh, old sensor pretty sure it does and right now we're gonna just shoot towards the trees and the clouds it's really overcast day how does it handle that contrast of the, the shadow and the highlights? This is not in any way scientific. It's just my curiosity of how it handles dynamic range and tones and color and all that. Alright, 400 F8. Closest we have on the Mamiya is a 350, 350th of a second, so we're gonna just do that. There's some dust on this thing. This does have a great shutter sound. Check it. All right, you there? Can you hear me? <laughs> a little different setup. Camera might be a little tight, I don't know. Suppose I should record my screen. Try to keep this efficient. Final thoughts on the camera, um, not, the, not the whole camera, we'll do something like that later. 
but the digital back compared to today's technology definitely, as you saw, sucks if you underexpose. Now I'm comparing this kind of to film now because film, underexposed, you get a lot of gross, grossness, <laughs> let's say grossness, in the shadow. This was already kind of lower on the exposure compared to the EOS R at the same settings. The highlight recovery on this uh, phase one back, really good compared to the EOS R. I've never shot Sony. I hear their highlight recovery is amazing. But for a 16 year old technology and it's medium format, so that has that I'm sure that pulls a lot of weight right there, but it's pretty good. It's, it's really good. It's gonna be fun to shoot with. I wanna do some more tests with it, but this was just for fun uh, as it's in my hands right now. So there we go. Hope you guys like this. It's I know it's been different. Uh, we're getting back to, I'm gonna be putting a little digital stuff in this channel here and there. Mostly film as that's what I'm kind of going into more and more and more in my business and for client work. So yeah, I'll see you guys next week in another video. Take care, stay healthy, and create something this week. All right, later.